What's up, YouTubers? Got another package today from Bravestar. Bravestar is a brand that I bought a denim shirt from, but have never tried their jeans. And I've been wanting to try their jeans for a long time. I pretty much only bought Naked and Famous. And I have one pair of Tanukis, but the only reason I have those is because I won them in a contest. I got lucky and my name was picked. So I got them. They were the Robert Indigo Open uh, times Tanuki collab. So I've been wanting to try these out for a long time. And I finally got a pair of jeans. I got a 10% discount code that I got from clicking one of their links through Instagram. And it gave me the option to sign up for a mailing list or something. And they sent me a code. So I was like, cool. And then I wasn't going to use it until I had seen something that I really liked and I really wanted. So I finally used it the other day and this is what I got. I got one of their natural veg tan leather belts. It's supposed to be like extra thick. I would have originally picked up a Naked and Famous one, but the sizing was a little confusing. And I don't know, I just never bothered to send them an email to see which size I should actually buy. Plus this one's made in the USA, so that's cool. Along with the jeans, obviously, but... <laughs> This is what I wanted to because the belts that I normally have are like probably half the size. So I wanted something thicker and didn't make it look like it was spaghetti wrapped around my waist. But I will try this on and see if it works or not. So that's item number one. But the main thing that I'm really hyped on is these jeans that I got from them. Their Pima on the warp and the weft. 13 ounce. I believe that they were called the Flame Pima. Patches, this leather patch is pretty dope. It's not as thick as Naked and Famous. I would say maybe it's like half the size of Naked and Famous. I do like how the belt loops are sewn into the waistband though that's awesome oh and they wrote stay raw this time on them when i got this shirt they didn't write it but i didn't really it didn't really matter but it's cool Yeah, it's the 13 ounce Flame Pima Cone Mill Selvage. Lately, I've been trying to stay away from anything that's under 14 or 15 ounces because it just seems like you get a sturdier jean when you go heavier. But I don't know, 13 ounces and those Pima warp and weft i was like i dude i gotta get it plus i had the discount code for 10 percent off so the size 33 on their site is listed as 35.5 and i'm like a 35 waist usually fits me like a little loose which is like what i like but i asked if they could find me one for 35 and they said they wouldn't make any guarantees but they would try so i was like all right i'm gonna have to see if these actually fit or not because they might be too big if they weren't able to find me one that was 35 waist. And the whole Made in America thing's pretty dope. I've been buying nothing but Made in Canadian <laughs> denim from Naked and Famous. So it's cool to, you know, buy only Made in America stuff. And they do the uh, selvage on the coin pocket. And then selvage on the button fly. Cone mills. This was really a three-in-one jean for me, too, to pick up because it's uh, Cone Mills, it's Pima, and it's a True Straight, which is something that 
I've wanted for a long time that I don't have in my wardrobe. This first button looks a little loose, like it wasn't done right maybe, but these other two feel great. That's kind of weird. I hope that that doesn't become a problem. The jeans look awesome so far. I mean, other than that button being a little weird or off, I don't see anything else that sticks out so far. And when you place your order, make sure you check your junk folder because for whatever reason, the email they had sent me about when I had sent the question in went to my junk folder for some reason. But, yeah, and they have two different emails too. But, all right, let's try these bad boys on, see how they are. The True Straight fits pretty great. I feel like if I were to go to the slim straight, they might be a little too tight or they might be just right. I don't know, but I'm pretty happy with the with the way they fit. They're like a little loose compared to my naked and famous in the waist. But I mean, heck for what I paid, I paid <clears throat> 138 bucks and then I got the 10% discount Aside from this one button kind of being weird They fit loose enough to where if they shrink some I feel like I'll be fine And I did not get I didn't pay the $15 to have them hemmed so I'll probably rock Japan cuff like this until after the first wash and then I'll get them hemmed. Now I got the full kit. I got the shirt and the jeans. I want the shirt on. The jeans match perfectly. They look good. It's not like one looks out of place. 